up, Whitey Nerdigans? This is the one and only Packer Girl 89 of Nerdigans, and today's manga Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for me and Robo Code chapter 171. But before I get into this recap and live reaction, we are at war with YouTube's algorithm, and it is slowly but surely killing my channel. And in order to defeat this algorithmic beast, please hit that like, share, and subscribe buttons. And because, of course, this channel, let alone this video, are not sponsored enough. We ain't sponsored by Shueisha and nah. We ain't sponsored by Manga Plus and nah. We ain't sponsored by Viz. And considering how much we promote Manga Plus on this channel, it's kind of surprising, right? <laughs> but if you love what we're doing and want to help keep me, my adorable Will Kitty, who's somewhere around here, in this operation literally alive and kicking, so we can keep bringing you more anime and manga content, whether it be news, analysis, or live reactions like this one, feel free to hit up our Cash Up and PayPal. Links are in the description box below. So... Um, well, last time I covered me and Roboco, we had, obviously, um, Roboco has a man's, whether she realizes it or not, she has a man's, and also Roboco's freaking song. Oh my god, that song is, was so stupid. Anyways, let's get to this chapter, see what's in store for us this week. What's wrong, Madoka? Your face looks as pale as a, as a Tycon radish. Roboco, um, Roboco, Bondo... I've got the Professional Association Apprentice exam coming up. So far, I've uh, just played for fun, but with this test, I, can, I can't just focus on my own enjoyment. You've been studying Shoki at home too, right? Maybe it'd be a good, uh, good to take a break once in a while. Yeah, but the test is coming up soon, so unless we do something that um, involves Shoki, I'm just going to be anxious. Ooh, title match commentary viewing hall. Wow, so this is the Kyosen uh, Tournament Round 2, Riku uh, Tendo Kyo versus Bar by Yoshiharu. And this chapter is titled The, uh, the Title Match of Madoka. All right, let's see. Um, this will be good for your shogi study and a nice break. Two birds with one stone, right? Uh, thank you, Roboco. I didn't realize we could come see uh, something like this so easily. Actually, Riku Tend uh, Tendo, who's competing today, is my teacher. He invited me. Um, he invited me. He said it would be a good experience and that I should study the, uh, the game closely. Oh, that makes sense. I don't know um, much about this stuff. What's a title match? Allow me to explain. In the world of Shogi, there are currently eight titles with, uh, um, with title match series held once a year between title holders and challengers. Uh, the number of matches and uh, available time per match varies between ti uh, titles. Huh? Tendo Sensei is uh, the strongest player in the game, currently holds five of those titles. Damn! Wow, Madoka, your teacher's seriously amazing! That's why there's a lot of attention on this match and why it's attracted some important figures. Hmm. <laughs> What's with the ominous vibe? Each one of them is a top pro gunning for Tendo. Well, literally, apparently. Um. Oh, uh, dunk Uh, someone collapsed! Probably a shogi novice. He appears to have fainted from the difference in strength um, between him and the pros. Wait, that could happen? Um, I put up a force field using my first down uh, cert uh, certificate. <laughs> Behind me, quick! Who knew that uh, certificate had that ability? Madoka, get over here, quick! Huh? Now I'm getting excited. She's just excited. Ah, the Dragon Ball face! Yee! That's Madoka for you. Her skill level uh, lets her stand up to them. This feels more like a power level situation. <laughs> it does. The professional players are all unique characters. Guys like Sergeant Mataro and Momoya. It makes me a little nervous how distinct their art styles are. <laughs> Seriously, the fuck? <laughs> the pros. Um, Madoka? Um, you're being weirder than any of them. Even I don't know what came over me. <laughs> Sorry, even I don't know what came over me. Uh, the Rio title holder is arriving. Wow, you can see the match room on the monitor. Here it comes. We should brace ourselves. Here comes a man who reigns supreme over um, 170 professionals. You braced yourself so much you turned photorealistic. <laughs> um, that's right, and he's my teacher. You do, Madoka! Do, Madoka giving, um, giving Tenken. That's what it is. It's like, wait a minute. Student no, this is some Tenken realness going on up in here. It was the youngest youngest player to ever turn pro and the strongest player in the game. The uh, five-hole title holder, Riku Tendo. Dude, Riku Tendo is... Oh God, I can't remember his name off the top of my head. It's very much like March comes in like a lion. If he's that good, this ought to be a cinch for him. No, it ain't gonna be that easy. Madoka? <laughs> yeah, the Popeye! The Dragon Ball Popeye. 
after all, he's facing uh, the Nine Dan and Lifetime Sevenfold title holder, um, Barb Yoshiharu. He's huge. He looks gigantic, but he's not actually that huge in person. His bedhead makes him look bigger than he actually is. This is in a matter of a couple of inches. It is, um, it is time. Tendo Ryu is playing black and has initiative. The match will begin with his move. The match begins. Here we go. Thank you for this match. Here it comes. Yes. Huh? But it's only the first move. Now, there it is. The opening T. What on earth is the opening T? What on earth is the keys? What are you doing? You're being a cat. That's what you're doing. What on earth is the opening T? The opening T is Tendo's standard routine. He just, he's just drinking tea though. No, Tendo Sensei has uh, effectively managed to drink tea in zero moves. Yeah, but just drinking tea. It will be hard for his opponent to remain mentally calm now. That little brat. It shouldn't be that hard. Then he simply played a uh, pawn to, uh, to six. And in response to the nine dawn um, Barb played, Barb has really lost the initiative here. At this rate, he could end up um, a total rout. Uh, it's not even the second move yet. Watch and learn, squirt. Hmm? The pawn, van uh, pawn vanished? Nothing to A4. He played nothing to A4. What monstrous power! He turned a pawn into nothing! That's still Madoka, right? Seriously! We're seeing all kinds of art styles today. But now that he's uh, down a pawn on the second move, Barb is in a tough position. Look, then what's he doing? But he used sheer force to overcome the disadvantage from the T. Is Shogi involved at this point? Um, Barb restored uh, the pawn he vanished and um, for his move played pawn to 8-4. So what was any of that for? Therefore, um, thereafter, play remained closely uh, matched into the mid game. Um, they attacked and defended uh, the advantage, swinging b uh, back and forth. My teacher is smiling. <laughs> Amazing! This is what it means to be a uh, professional. This is the this is a true competition. The end game. Each the end game. Each player had only one minute left for moves. It had been a brilliant match with turnabout after turnabout, such that a win from either um, either play. Uh, Seemed possible, but it was too a uh, close, um, too a close, uh, too close to call. Wait, too a uh, close by. It says too a uh, close by here. What the fuck? Is this supposed to be um, too close to? Whatever. The five hold uh, title holder Tendo. Um, I am defeated. Tendo wins. I can't believe he got to meet Ten. We get to meet Tendo Sensei thanks to Madoka being a student. Uh, clear the way. Stretcher coming through. Moro. I mean, uh, Tendo Sensei. Oh, hello, Madoka. Uh, sorry you have to see me like this. Are you all right? Um, I'm not very hardy at the best of times, so after a long match, I'm always like this. This is the path you're walking. If you want to turn back, now's the time. No. I want to play more than ever. Yeah, dude, Madoka's so hardcore. I love it. You're pretty tough. As Madoka watched her teacher go, she was filled with a new, um, she was filled anew with resolve. Her next goal is, uh, to pass the Professional Association Apprentice Exam. Is that gonna be what's happening next chapter? Okay. But dude, this chapter, <laughs> dude, me and Romico's so stupid. I, I freaking love it. I love this manga so much. Uh, I, the only thing I wish that we had a little bit more of is, um, especially with me and Robico in particular, um, is translate uh, translation notes give us I don't know what happened we were getting a ton of translation notes for a while but it's just stopped all of a sudden I wonder part of me thinks this is Viz is doing the editorial department's doing which really annoys the hell out of me I fucking can't stand Viz I can't it's getting to the point where I'm starting to think maybe like I should just take the time for certain uh, series to just translate it out my uh, the Spanish version out myself because that one's more accurate but Shweisha, I swear to God, you need your own localizations on Manga Plus. And that applies to me and Robico as well. We get more translation notes if uh, Shweisha had their own localization for me and Robico on Manga Plus and let Viz bastardize their own localizations. But it is what it is for now. Anyways, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below what you guys think. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigan Zinc. Um, love what we're doing and want to help keep this operation alive and kicking so we can keep bringing you more Robico content. A few ways you could do that. Donate to our cash app, PayPal, Patreon. Purchase something off our Amazon wish list. All that's in the description box below. 
Also, make sure you follow us on Twitter, Twitch, Discord, friend us on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Until next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later. Bye.